Hello, kids. It is me, your friend, the Count. And I'm here to pass on a message from our friends at Six Cigar Health Services. A lot of people have asked us if Halloween is canceled this year. Well, kids, to some, canceling Halloween would be like canceling Christmas. <laughs> it just ain't gonna happen. Huh? <laughs> so we're here to help guide you into having a safer, spooky time this Halloween season. First things first, you must ask yourself these questions. Do I have any new or changing symptoms? Have I traveled outside of Alberta or Canada in the last 14 days? Have I been in contact with any ill person or confirmed or probable case of COVID-19? If you answered yes to any of these questions, we ask that you please refrain from participating in any Halloween activities. But if you answered no, well then, let us explore ways in which you can continue to reduce your risk and have a safe time. Wear a non-medical face mask that covers your nose, mouth, and chin while participating in any Halloween activities. Choose costumes that allow you to wear a non-medical mask. If your costume includes a mask, wear a non-medical face mask underneath your Halloween mask. If you can, knock instead of pushing doorbells or keep two meters from the door or porch and call Trick or treat! Maintain two meters distance from anyone who does not live in your household while participating in any Halloween activities. Wait until you are home and have washed your hands before handling candy. Refrain from sharing food, drinks, candy with others as COVID-19 can spread easily from saliva. With a parent or trusted adult, check your candy for signs of tampering, like you would any other year. For added safety, wipe down your candy with any disinfecting wipes. If none are available to you, then stash your candy for one, two, three days. Ah, 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 ah. After three days, any COVID germ should die like your old friend the Count would if I ever were to see sunlight. It is important to remember that people can still be contagious with COVID-19 and show no symptoms. For additional guidance for trick-or-treating, handing out candy from home or work, and attending Halloween gatherings, visit SixGaHealth.com and be sure to stay tuned for more tips on how to be safe.